I was traveling for business and I went to the bathroom one morning and I saw blood in my stool. And I was very concerned. Bleeding continued for about two months. So I decided to call a gastroenterologist myself. They said that I was not too young for colon cancer. So we had a colonoscopy. They found a tumor, said that that is what was causing the bleeding and that, uh, that I had stage three colon cancer. I was 38 years old. One of the horrors of cancer is the fear of recurrence. To have to wait for your scan every six months, you are imagining that you are going to hear again that you have cancer, it's come back, and that this time it's going to be stage four. That is a terrifying idea and it sits with you day after day after day. So to know that there is a test out there that can tell you your odds of that are very low changes your life. It allows you to go back, back to living again. I first heard about Signaterra from my oncologist. My CEA was on the rise and I was really concerned about it. And he said, we have two options. One is a PET scan or the other is there is this new test out there called Signaterra. We would take your tumor, send it in. They will look at your DNA, come up with a specialized test just for you. And then we can determine if you have any residual disease in your blood. I was thrilled, thrilled to have that as an option because PET scan, tons of radiation or personalized blood test, no downside, and can actually detect cancer down to the molecule. It's a no brainer. I think that a lot of oncologists are worried that a positive Signatara test would cause more anxiety than not knowing at all. But as a patient, I would much prefer to know as soon as possible that my cancer still exists, even if we can't do anything about it right away. Because I'm already worried about it. I'm already stressed about it. And having the certainty either way is what really counts. I was on vacation with my husband. We had just woken up and there was a voicemail from my oncologist. <laughs> This Congratulations. Is negative. It's the most euphoric sense of relief and happiness I've ever felt in my life. It was the first time that I could finally feel like I did it, that this is, this is behind me, that I beat this cancer and that I'm going to live. It's been just over a year since I finished treatment. It's been seven or eight months since my first negative Signatera, and I'm waiting for my fourth. Now I have learned to cook. I have started my first garden, and I've been staying involved with the cancer community, trying to mentor other cancer patients as they begin this journey. I feel so fulfilled, and um, I mean, life is great.